February is also Heart Health Month, and one man who defied the odds surviving cardiac arrest has tips to keep us all healthy, not just this month, but all year round. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Brian Campbell has more on his story this morning from the newsroom. Good morning, Brian. Yes, good morning, Nicole. Mike Alvarez is in the 1% of people who survive a heart attack outside the hospital. He and his doctors say a healthy lifestyle is the top way to prevent heart disease. Last year, January 30th, I had a heart attack. Meet Mike Alvarez. He just had his year anniversary of surviving a heart attack caused by a complete blockage in the main artery of his heart. Technically, I was dead for about 10, 15 minutes. Now, Mike has made a complete lifestyle change. He says eating healthy and being active are huge in keeping your heart in top shape. The diet and exercise is, is the big thing, especially the exercise, because it's, it's pushing that blood through your heart. It's getting your heart to pump, and that's helping, you know, get your arteries in shape. Dr. Johnson was the cardiologist who operated on Mike when he got to the hospital. He echoes Mike's advice, saying diet is a huge proponent of a healthy heart. The diet itself is something that we want to uh, consider a heart healthy alternative and that's most closely resembles what the American Heart Association and the American College of Cardiology uh, recommends more of a Mediterranean style diet. That includes fresh fruits and veggies, lean proteins like chicken or fish, and portion control. According to Mike, his experience has sparked change for those around him. If that can happen to him, he was only 45, then, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm such and such age. Maybe I need to go get checked out. Maybe I need to make some changes in my lifestyle. Going to your doctor regularly is also important, as symptoms of heart disease don't always appear as they do in a textbook. Any symptom that's new, that's concerning, or even if it comes on with exertion, relieve with rest, should be something that you talk to your doctor about. But the biggest thing Mike wants people to focus on during this month. CPR. CPR is the big thing that people should know. After all, it was the quick thinking by his friends the day he collapsed on that basketball court that kept Mike alive and with his family today. The American Heart Association has tons of additional tips on their website about living a heart-healthy lifestyle. There's also a free online screening on Brian Hart's website to see how healthy your heart is. Mike has an incredible story, very inspirational, Brian, and we're glad that he shared it with you so you could share it with us. Thanks so much.